In this video, we will see a kind of extended development loop. So we start with some simple data, as usually, points and points, and we decide that we want to use the mouse over for that. So we go to testing, show the window, and mouse over not working. Hmm, interesting. We have in mind that in snippets there is some code to support the age over, which is this one. We go to testing now, we will see if this one is selected to. Okay, show plot in your window, everything is fine, but not working. One more time. So, check. Checking. Oh! In GWT, we have to set the same option so that this works. Okay, let's do it. Go to GWT, the mouse over, go to testing, show, and it works. Fine. This was the first step. We remove this now. And what's about some different kind of data? There's something called the bandwidth. Okay, in the bandwidth, we first of all see that we need a plugin and we need an additional plugin for the time. So let's go to the plugins, the bandwidth first, and the time, which is a part of Lot Core, the time. Well, let's close it, go to options, the bandwidth, we have to set this to be active. Let's go to testing, the new window, oh, even the age over, the mouse over works. Perfect, but we don't like this option, so we set the y-axis, sorry, y-axis, the minimum to, let me say, 50, go to testing, okay. there's still a problem because we don't have selected the time in the options. So on the x-axis, the mode has to be set to time. Staying, doing this, and perfect. Now that we have used a lot of plugins, as you can see here, might be in a good idea to create a minified version of all of them. Nothing easier than that. Click on this button. Thanks to the help of Google, you will get a minified version immediately. Okay, that's it. Later you will get some more videos, hopefully.